Hey y'all, this week's quick tip is a tiny little update to pageless docs inside Google Docs. Ah, look at that. If you want to pin this header, you now can. Let me show you how this works. Hey y'all, so a few months ago, I talked about something called pageless docs, which I love and I'm using in my list of Google quick tip videos um, that I have on a Google doc. It's a massive table. And if it had page breaks, it would just really make that table hard to understand. But one of the things that makes it even easier to use is that we can now pin the header row. Now, this table is not terribly complicated. It only has two columns, but this is something that many of you may be used to using inside Google Sheets as well, freezing that header row so that it stays with you as you keep scrolling. But now, if you are using a table inside Pageless Stocks, you can pin the header of that row. So now when I scroll, that header stays right there and makes it so much easier to understand the information on the page. Love this. I love pageless stocks and I love tables. So this was perfect for me. If you like this tip, give me a thumbs up, ring the bell and subscribe. And you know what? If you haven't already, hop on over to shakeuplearning.com and check out all the free resources we have there. Bye y'all.